So I missed you yesterday. Oh, you did, did you? I had everything set up for us to make Hot Pockets together, and then you never called, I never heard from you, you didn't text, I got worried. President had all the plans for us. To pass out glasses to everyone to watch the eclipse. But then in the middle of Iraq, they do this sneak emergency fake count to lock us all in and keep us locked in for the day. Ian shut our tablets off so we can't communicate with families or anyone. And a lot of punishments being here not for you to mess with us and take things away. And, and like I said before, it's, like, it's, it's a privilege for me to have contact. Like, it's not a privilege for our families, our friends, our girlfriends, or whatever, our kids. It's a, it's a right for them. And here and now you stepped on the line and we'll never see another one. Yeah. Maybe somebody will. And the whole reason why we have tablets, the goal is for communication. Because people don't mail anymore. People don't send letters and stuff anymore. It's just obsolete. And one of the biggest focuses of someone's rehabilitation at present is their family contact, their family ties. Sorry. No, you're no, you're not rambling. You're bringing up really good points. I mean, you're right. Like your punishment is being there and being separated from the rest of society. It's not what the guards do to you. Like, that's not right. Lock us in, that's fine, whatever, you got that. Now you're taking my communication. Like, us here on the outside, who have people on the inside that we care about, I mean, it's worrisome. When you're expecting to hear from someone, and then you don't. You text, you don't get a text back, you expect a phone call, you don't get a phone call. I mean, it's, because anything can happen. It's a lot of reasons. <laughs> you know, some benign and, and some... Yeah, I am. Some not yeah, so much. Right. Like, when I asked the sergeant about why they shut the prison down, she got so offended, like, I was like, why are you shut the whole prison down? We well, didn't shut the whole prison down. I said, yeah, you did. You shut, you shut industries down. You made them all come back. You shut the direct building down. No one's working. No movement. Everyone's locked in. No classes, nothing. Shut college down, everything. Oh, my gosh. They shut the industries down and... Everything. The whole prison. One of the reasons that one of the sergeants said to it, from with um, Eclipse was at 3 or 3.30. He didn't want everyone coming back from staying at REC and coming back at 3.30 so they could watch the Eclipse. You know, we've, we've come so, to a place where when I first got here, we didn't talk to COs, captains, sergeants, deputy wardens, wardens. That didn't happen. It didn't, you didn't go to the desk without the buddy system. You didn't talk. It just didn't happen. And now we're at the spot but we've kind of humanized it, you know. We've changed the dynamics of this prison, but COs don't like that. Yeah, you've told me you know? before, like when you first, when you first got to MSP, it was a lot more us versus them, and some of that dynamics yeah. changed. But then I hear things like this, and I wonder. You, um, got certain, you got certain ones that are still in power that now they get promoted more. They don't like us. They don't think we should have anything. They don't think we should have any respect. They don't think they should, you know, and I, and I get it. Respect's earned. It really is. I, I'm all about that, but. Well, I mean, there's different kinds of respect, and there's, like, basic human respect that everybody deserves. I mean, I understand what you're saying about respect is earned, and, and to some degree, but, you know, we're all people. Yeah. You know, I mean, everybody in there is somebody's son. So when I was making my burrito yesterday, I kept thinking about you telling me to trust the process. <laughs> oh, did you? <laughs> I got a little nervous with the chip bag. Why? What would make you nervous about it? <laughs> microwave in a chip bag. It sounded oh, yeah. scary. <laughs> well, you know, just microwave a chip bag. That's why you wrapped the ink-covered newspaper around it. You're right. The newspaper protected it. You have one minute remaining. Thanks, prison Siri. Um, <laughs> you gonna call me back? I sure am. <laughs> I sure am. Thank you for using Global Tel Link.